So right now, I'm downtown Charlotte, about to walk to the hotel, and then I'm going to check out Duke University, man. Went there last year. I didn't get a chance to vlog it, but this year, guess what I'm doing? I'm vlogging the University of Duke. Is it Duke University or University of Duke? Either way, I can't wait to see it again. It's historic, it's iconic, and I get a chance to check it out one more again. D Rich TV vlog, man. It's been a very, very busy day already, man. The gym was packed as usual. And I feel sorry when people ask me, you know, to come film them because it's only one of me and I can only do so much. But tomorrow, I'll get a chance to check out a lot more people because it'll be bracket play and in bracket play, people will meet up and it will be very good games. Each game should be a good game and that way I can get more done. But when it's pool play, it's hard for me. It's very hard. It's only one of me. So for everybody out there who wants me to come check out their game, in due time, in due time. We already know, man. I'm about to head to. We here, baby. We in there. You already know about to head to Duke University, man. Fun to, fun to have a dunk they said they, they said they want to come see me work out in person, so I said I can make it up there. Oh, okay. So I can get that scholarship offer. Come on, boys. You know what's going on? Might walk over with that scholarship. Full ride. Hey, so this dude right here, he lied and said he lost his phone. He swore to God he lost his phone. Yo, I just found it. Jai had it in his bag. Yo, didn't Jai have it? But guess what though? That's what happened though when you get over 50,000 Instagram followers. People act, start acting funny, man. Yeah. Hey, he had 30k. I can see him getting there. Once he get to 50, he gonna start acting totally different. That's how they do, man. So right now, so right now we jammed up in the van. Once again, it was the same way last year, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. You were driving, wasn't you? No, I was not driving. I was sitting in the back of somebody's car. I think it was a uh, Mr. Sturry. Did you ever drive? Yeah, I drove. I drove. I drove down here seven hours. So where you at? When we in the car, we do it. Yeah. Rich, I said it was you me, be, Corey, Ron, Ronnie, Bryce. Nah. Y'all want to drive me? I do like hunting on the U.S. That's good. You that's know? what Joe was doing. Oh, well, that's, that's good. good. Get there fast. But anyways, man, I got to get to Duke University so I can get the scholarship. Man, they want to see me work out in person, like I said before. About to get there, maybe um, check out the campus. I already know what the campus looks like, but it's always good to go back and see it, man. It's hot. What's the weather right now? Like 95 degrees, 96? Yeah. He got some black and white J's on. I don't know if they black and white, green and white, blue and white. I guess they change. Ah. I guess they change with the sun, man. <laughs> the original certified. Listen, everybody making up their own gang. We hoodie certified. It's only a few. It's only a few official gangs, okay? I'm no, a white boy I'm gang. Hoodie certified, period, bro. I'm hoodie certified, bro. No, no, I'm saying are you? White boy gang. <laughs> what gang are you? We slaughter gang. We slaughter gang. We slaughter gang. We boy, Ronnie, Rod, slaughter gang. We slaughter gang. And Jaden. Be rich. You know better, bro. You know better. I would be slaughter gang, but they said they don't want white boys in slaughter gang. Hey, you want to be a slaughter gang? You go for me. I'm not. I'm not a cat. Bad. No. Hey, who's this? Who's this six eight? Who's this six eight doing the gas station right here? How you liking it so far? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. Uh, you know, learning a lot about my body. Uh, you know, the days here are long. Get up at like seven thirty. <laughs> you don't really go to sleep till like twelve because you got homework. Facts. You know, if you're trying to be the best, you gotta get up extra shots. Facts. Nice. That's good. How you feeling? Feeling good. Yeah. Look like you're starting to chill it off. So, uh, a little bit. <laughs> Keep it up, man. Appreciate, it. Appreciate you. Oh, you said you wanted to ask me. You want to try to find me? I got you. I got you. I'll talk to my group. Hey, before you. You, Joe, before you go, mm -hmm. I know you talked about getting up. What's, what, what is the most important thing that you want to tell these guys moving forward as far as um, preparing themselves to get to this level? Um. It's a lot of kids out there. I mean, believe it or not, it's hundreds, thousands, millions of kids. Like, everybody want to get a scholarship offer. So when you're in the gym, that one set you might want to take off, it's probably a kid somewhere else that's probably not taking that set off. And, you know, you always hear about them late bloomers, your junior, senior year. They might take that scholarship from you that you want. When did you start getting noticed? I started getting noticed, like, my sophomore summer. 
So it wasn't seventh grade, eighth grade. Nah, uh, I was one of the kids. Late bloomer. Yeah, late bloomer. So. Hey, so I got a question for you. So what made you like stay in your hometown and play? Besides go to like a prep school, you know everybody goes like the prep school route. Um, my parents always taught me, you know, if you're a real baller, coaches will find you. You don't have to relocate. It's real talk. So right now we in a Duke locker room. I didn't get my scholarship yet. <laughs> Just give me a tour of the of the building. Let you see the. So give me a who Duke starting five next year. Uh, Trey Jones, Trey Jones, Marquise, Marquise Bowden, Cam, Cam Zion, 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 and RJ. That's the starting five. I don't. I, th I thought it was five. It was gonna be five freshmen starting. He's not a. He's not a freshman. He? Multi sport. Bowden. Sophomore, right? Or junior? Hmm. Nobody gonna come through. And then I might be coming up. Nolan, what's going on? It's one more freshman, bro. Good What's my vert? What's your shoe game? What's your shoe game looking like in there? You got some, you got some heat in there, man. No, 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 no. Nolan, come here, come here. I need Nolan over here for this one. Come, come on, Nolan. What's up? He said, "What my shoe game looking right?" So right now I got some decent Kyrie's, but you know, like Nolan, my shoe game looking little. What is yeah, this, yeah, bro? That's not, look, look, look. Nolan, let's not show this. Let's not show Nolan, this, what, what's going on? <laughs> the special order's on the they way, gave me right? some, <laughs> Yo, they gave me these from like two, three years ago. I mean, I messed with them, but <laughs> what's going on, Nolan? What's them right there? Some Kyrie's below there? Oh, yeah, I love these right here, though. I mess with these Kyrie's, though. Yeah, 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 no. You see, I got the dude color bronze on the So what's your favorite shoe to hoop in? Bronze or Kyrie's? You don't wear low tops, do you? You wear low tops? No, I wear some low tops. Uh, it depends on the shoe, um, but I'll probably wear LeBron's more than Kyrie's. Though. What the PGs? PGs? I like the PG twos. Like so them. let me ask you this: Who got the best hoop shoe? Nike hoop shoe? <coughs> KD, Kyrie, Bron, <coughs> PG. <laughs> hey, be honest, keep it one hundred percent honest. I'm gonna keep it honest. honest. Kyrie. Okay, Kyrie. it depends on the person. Like somebody like me, like. Not gonna sit here and wear like no low tops all the time, so it really depends on the person. But if you talking about design wise, PG. Oh, I like KDs, bro. I go with Kyrie. I go with Kyrie. Yeah, Kyrie. Kyrie. Kyrie's, bro. Black, Black, yeah, Kyrie. Okay. Which one? Okay. I got to call my dad. <laughs> my dad be putting out some weak shoes. Now let me must admit, I'm not really a Duke fan. But it is interesting coming back here, just seeing it. Oh, deep, bro, deep. All the magical moments that happen here. You know Duke is crazy this year, bro. Duke does have a very good incoming freshman class, but sometimes that doesn't mount up to what it should be. All right, watch. Oh, 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 they got a they got a starting five already, hey, bro. Hey. Look, we going to real talk. I don't think I don't think Zion gonna jam, family. I think he was just saying that, so. <laughs> <laughs> So this dude right here said, he said the only reason I got Yeezys is because of the hype. It is because of the hype. That's now, now, now vlog, now vlog, let me tell you something. You guys know that Kanye West is my favorite artist of all time. You guys do know that. Back in high school, they used to call me the Young Kanye. That's the truth. Now you, on the other hand, can you name a Kanye West album? Um, yikes. That's not an album, that's a song. Name a Kanye West album that came out before this last I project. Uh, I don't know. Cause he's whack. He's bogus. He's whack. He's not good. He can't rap. He can't, he doesn't spit nothing. So who's your favorite, who's your favorite artist? My favorite, Drake. Young boy. Drake. Young boy. Drake. Now Drake is my favorite rapper. Kanye West is my favorite artist. Can you, do you know the difference, y'all? Do you know the difference between the artist and the rapper? Kanye West makes the best projects. So right now, we in the practice facility right now. Everybody putting up shots. We got Zion Williamson over there working on this game, man. Post practice, Zion Williamson putting in that work, man. You see what it takes to make it, man. You gotta be in here all day, man. He over there, I ain't gonna get up in his face because he putting in work. I had my first dunk, plus three. So when you get your first dunk, bro? 
I got my first dunk in ninth grade, man. So, uh, so what you think about all these middle schoolers dunking on? What you, what you think about that? Man, that's that's crazy. They dunking in seventh grade. It's not just like a dunk. They windmilling, man. That's that's so deep. So let me ask you this: What do I gotta do right now to get a shout out in your story on Instagram? What do D Rich TV gotta do? Put them in or, or, cause you, cause you, cause you, cause you, didn't, you got like a, what, two million followers now, three million, one point six, that's some slight, you know what I mean? <laughs> so what, the, so what do I gotta do? Hit a three from half court? Or can I get, get Gabe shooter for me? Okay, so, so if Gabe make a shot on three, I get it. I'm trying to get the fifty k, bro. I'm at forty eight point forty eight, forty eight point six. <laughs> hey Gabe, I'm depending on you, man. If you miss, don't ever talk to me again, man. You might want to make me. D Rich TV vlog, man. Hit the game. Come on, bro. I'm not trying to get the ball. Gabe, <laughs> I'm really depending on you for real. I'm serious. I'll try. I'm getting a shout out too if I make it. So it's not like I'm going to miss on purpose. I'm not trying to get that ball. Hit. Hey, hold it for three shots. One more. Okay. It was close. It was online. Hey. Watch out, Jay. Ah. I'll get the last one. Sorry. Come on. It's over, man. No, come on, get a ball. Small ball. Yeah, it's small ball. Bronny, let me see that ball real quick. I'm here. Throw me one. If, if, if you make a shot from half court, I get a shot off from Zion on IG. Wait, you get a, a shot off? Right, I get, get a shot off. Watch out, boy. How did you get a shot off? Because I, I, I made the bet. I told Gabe, because I said Gabe can shoot for me. Yeah. Ooh, dude, last one. Actually, yeah. 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 Give me that. Oh, hey. Give me hey. 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 Hey, I need my shot off, man. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Hey man, this is on the story, man. Hey, he hit it, bro. He hit it, bro. <laughs> hey. Hey. A bet is a, hey, a bet is a bet, right? Yo, man. Okay, all right, okay. I ain't gonna press you now. At Drish TV, man. At, you see the sock? You see the? You see the socks right there? At Drish TV, man. Hey. What you think about these Yeezys right there? Ugly, trash. Okay. They straight to okay. me. It just like depends okay. on like what you wear with them. See your fit right now is straight. Right. But you know like wear it with like some jeans or something. And like a long shirt, I don't think it'll work, but I think it depends on Just walking around, cooling. Like, uh, okay. Like, don't try to wear it like, like they some, I'm about to go out to this fly place. Don't try to wear them like that, it ain't gonna work. So let me ask you this. The Yeezy really jump over jump, man? Like you said, do you think Yeezys is more Hard to get than Jordans. Yeah. I mean, Yeezy's kind of watering down now, but. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna say they're a little hard to get than Jordans. See, Jordans, you know, Flight Club got you with them, but Yeezy's, they be, they be gone, man. So what's your shoe when you go out, step out, what you, what you rock? Do you rock Vans a little bit or something? Jordans. I don't wear Vans. I be Jordans, Jordans uh, Yeezy's, or like, probably like some Nikes with like a, Warm up on or something. Keep it cool. Keep it. Cool. I like to dress comfortable, man. Yeah. Hey, so so you from Canada, right? I'm a D Rich, D Rich man, D Rich TV. You probably never heard of him before. Yeah, they gonna push. So how did Drake bounce back from that push? Let's yeah. see What you think? What you think? How did he bounce back? I think he bounced back with an album that's going crazy. So I, I don't see Pusha T doing that. So. Facts. Fact. Hey, Drake, I think he the best out. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> you going to the OVO Fest? Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so I just worked out for the Duke coaches, put up 50 shots, made 37 of them. What's that percentage, Gabe? 37 out of 50? Too slow. 72. 70 percent. 70 Gabe said 72 percent. 74. 74. 74 percent. So I just won 74 percent from the three. But they say they don't have enough scholarships for me right now, so I have to come back sometime next year and see what I can do, man. Unfortunately. 
Hey, so so what I got to do to get a scholarship to Duke, man? Like I never, I never played high school basketball, I never AAU basketball, but if I start working now, how long do you think it'd take for me to to, to reach that level, man? Right, so you ain't you ain't play high school basketball or nothing? They ain't play high school basketball. All right, in that situation, if I'm being like realistic, um, you'll probably have to talk to Coach K or your assistant coaches, you know, see if they got any spots available on the roster. He's not gonna offer you no scholarship out the bat, so you gotta like walk on. Kind of like earn your spot and then maybe after a year, you're working hard, showing that you actually want to be a part of the team. I think he offers scholarship. So you're telling me there's a chance? A small chance. Very, very small chance. <laughs> so that's a wrap, man. Just didn't get a scholarship. That's okay. I'll be back next year, work on my game. I might head down to Chapel Hill and see if I can get a scholarship there. Yeah. By the, um, the rival. At least you got a shout out. I, I did get a shout out thanks to you. Thanks to this man right here. Cool. Hit a jump shot, got me a shout out, man. Pretty good trip, man. Yeah, maybe I get the scholarship next year, right? You? Yeah, I ain't get it this Easy. year. Easy. I ain't get it last year either, man. Shave your beard <laughs> so they don't know that you have facial hair, so you can grow. <laughs> so they know you can grow. All right. Uh, I'm it. will be good. Yeah. All right, I got it. Yeah. Super Bowl goals. I'm at the crib of Puff. He got Kaepernick on the phone. He in a whole different mode.